So you're dressed to the nines. Yep. Is that a new word? You're dressed in your best finery. You have your appropriate hat, whether it be metal, leather, or cloth. Your garb is not complete. Your demeanor is not as it should be without a rubber chicken. A rubber chicken? Yes. This can go in the belt. <laughs> yep. It can go in the hat. It can be sneakily tucked under your doublet. And it's a handy parrying device. <laughs> <laughs>
Are there tiny cats that put their paw prints on the tiny books too? Oh, <laughs> we use regular size cats so you get the full paw print experience. <laughs> <laughs> We <laughs> <laughs> keep them separately. They're very well fed cats. Is that Viking free? <laughs> they are Viking free. Oh. They are too small for the Vikings to see. Everyone knows they're nearsighted. Oh. <laughs> so, come see me today for your micro books. Thank you. <laughs>
<laughs> so I am not good at this. We, however, have discovered a new thing. It's called writing. And what they do is they take these small trees and they mash them up and they put them in these things. And you can put whatever you want on this and you can remember this. No longer does one have to remember all of what's his name saga or how to make the greatest stuff or where the hell that church thing is. We can write it down. We can keep it. We can give these away. We can hold these. I am more than willing if I can remember where exactly I found these, to bring these to you and sell them to you so you too can get the best rating in. They are selling these micro thingies with apparently little animal prints and such on them, but we can put whatever we want. We can even put the places where they make them and then we can just pick them up. The newest thing in Norse technology, writing in smaller, easier to carry books. Thank you. <laughs>
So act now and contact your local Venetian merchants. <laughs> <laughs>